On September the 25th, President of the Hidrali Foundation, Mehr Ben Aliv, and Vice President of the Foundation, Leila Aliv, arrived at kindergarten number 289 in Buzovna settlement. Azerbaijan's first lady saw the photo stand reflecting the previous stage of the kindergarten. Bakume Hajbola Butalubov said the kindergarten built in 1978 had never been repaired. In accordance with the state program on socio-economic development of Baku and surrounding settlements for 2011-2013, the kindergarten started to be repaired in 2012. All conditions have been created here. 112 children between 2 and 6 divided into 6 groups will be educated here by professional specialists. MP Mehri Ben Aliva asked about the number and conditions of the kindergarten situated in Buzovna settlement. She was told that 4 out of 6 kindergartens had undergone major repair. Further, President of the Hydraulic Foundation Mehri Ben Aliva attended the opening of kindergarten number 246 in the same settlement. The kindergarten, built in 1985, had never been reconstructed in the result it needed repair. On the initiative of the Hydrali Foundation, a new kindergarten was built in the place of the old one. The new conditions met modern requirements. Mary Benaliva was told the preschool educational institution will also have the Russian department. Totally, there will be 212 children divided into 11 groups. The kindergarten has been supplied with necessary equipment. The inventory was provided by the Hydrali Foundation. The courtyard has been planted with trees, playground has been created. Later, President of the Hydrali Foundation, Meher Ben Aliva, and Vice President of the Foundation, Leila Aliva, arrived at the opening ceremony of Kindergarten 214 in Turkan settlement of Buzovna district. The kindergarten, built at the initiative of the Hydrali Foundation, totally covers 6,000 square meters. The surroundings have been rehabilitated, trees and flowers have been planted, a football pitch was created and attractions were installed. Two hundred children divided into ten groups will be educated here. All rooms have been provided with necessary visual aids. There is a music hall, sports hall, a playground, canteens and a swimming pool in the kindergarten. Next, a community polyclinic opened in Turkan. The medical facility was built at the initiative of the Hydrali Foundation. It covers 1.7 hectare of area where green belts were created. A new lighting system was installed. There are 36 rooms in the two-storied building. The X-ray, stomatology, gynecology, operation, USI, cardiology and ophthalmology rooms have been provided with the latest equipment. The conditions created here once again prove that development of the health care system is also in the focus of the Hydraulic Foundation along with other spheres. The Foundation supports the reconstruction and repair of the medical facilities in the country. A number of newly constructed medical institutions and the modern equipment brought to the country serve one important mission to protect the health of the Azerbaijan people. Later that day, Azerbaijan's First Lady Mehri Ben Aliva and Vice President of the Hydraulic Foundation Leila Aliva attended the opening of Day Nursery number 285 in the capital's Bina settlement, the following construction. The First Lady was told, built in 1985, the building of the nursery was demolished in March 2013 because of disrepair and rebuilt on the initiative of the Hydraulic Foundation. <laughs> Mehr Ben Aliva and Leila Aliva viewed a photo stand reflecting the institution before and after. A photo corner showing national leader Hydraulic and bearing his name Foundation's child care activities has been created in the foyer of the nursery. Azerbaijan's First Lady Mehri Ben Aliva and Vice President of the Hydraulic Foundation Leila Aliva came to the nursery's canteen and saw the conditions created here. At the 220 seat nursery, children will get education in the Russian and Azerbaijani languages. Mehri Ben Aliva took a close look at the entertainments available for the kids. President of the Hydraulic Foundation was briefed on the rehabilitation works carried out in the nursery's territory. Azerbaijan's First Lady and Vice President of the Hydraulic Foundation viewed the music room supplied with many musical instruments and the gym fixed out with necessary sports equipment.